Hello, my name is Maria Miller from MathMammoth.com and this is Mathy, my mascot and assistant. In this lesson we're going to study, study temperature and I intend this lesson for about third or fourth grade. Now, we have two scales commonly used to measure temperature. First one being the Celsius scale and that is used in almost all the world and the second one being the Fahrenheit scale which is used in the United States. And for the Celsius scale, there are two points that define it, two temperatures. First one being 0 degrees Celsius, which is when water freezes, and then 100 degrees Celsius, which is when water boils. Okay, these two points define the Celsius scale. And the corresponding points in the Fahrenheit scale are 32 degrees when water freezes, and then 212 degrees Fahrenheit when water boils. Okay, let's look at some examples here. Most people think that nice weather, comfortable weather and comfortable temperature is about 20 something in the Celsius scale. And in the Fahrenheit scale it ends up being 70 something. Okay? And then beyond that we go to hot weather. Above 30 degrees, so between 30 and 40 is hot weather. Okay? In Fahrenheit it is something like 80, 90, even more than 100 degrees Fahrenheit is hot weather. Then below 20 we get into like fall cool weather and of course below zero we have snow and ice, winter, you know. And in the Fahrenheit the fall and cool weather would be below 70, like 60 something, 50 something, 40 something, even 30 something. And then winter weather, if you have snow and ice in the winter, it would be below 32. 20 something, 10 something, 0, even negative numbers. Okay? And then one more thing I want to point out, and that is this temperature here. It is the normal body temperature for human beings. In Celsius, it is 37 degrees Celsius, and in Fahrenheit, it is 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. So above that, you have fever. Let's say 38 degrees, or 37.5, 39, 40, 41, 42 is fever. And in Fahrenheit you might have 99 degrees, or 100, 100, 102. Over here, these would be fever temperatures. Now, we're going to study and look in a little bit into integers, into negative numbers, using temperature. And thinking of temperature falling and rising. And even fourth graders, third graders can easily understand that. Let's say, for example, that the temperature is 2 degrees Celsius, and it is chilly weather, okay? What is it, Matthew? Matthew's saying he doesn't mind that at all. He has lots of fur. He can keep warm. Well, it is 2 degrees Celsius and it falls 3 degrees. If it is 2 degrees and it falls 3 degrees, it goes just 1 degree below zero. So we write, of course, minus 1 degree Celsius. If, if the temperature is now 3 degrees Celsius and it falls 6, we add 3. We go down 3 degrees to 0 and another 3 degrees below 0, so we are at minus 3 degrees Celsius. If it is now 1 degree Celsius and it falls 5, first you go down to 0, 1 degree, and then 4 degrees more down, all to negative 4, minus 4 degrees Celsius. Oh, you can use Fahrenheit scale, it doesn't matter. Let's say we have negative 2 degrees Fahrenheit and the temperature rises to degrees. You are 2 degrees below zero, temperature rises to, so you come at a zero. Zero degrees Fahrenheit. Or negative 4 degrees Fahrenheit and it rises 5 degrees, so then you come out of your negatives to zero and one more. You are 1 degrees Fahrenheit. Or you are at 7 degrees, negative 7 degrees. You're at minus 7 Fahrenheit and the temperature rises 10 degrees. So minus 7 and 7 degrees, minus 7 and then 7 more will bring you up to 0 and then 3 more above that. So you're at 3 degrees Fahrenheit. These are integer additions and subtractions in disguise. Whenever it is rising, it's addition. Falling means it's subtraction. Negative 9 degrees Celsius and the temperature falls 2 degrees. It gets colder again. 
So we at negative 9 and the temperature gets colder. So the temperature drops and goes down. It goes to negative 11 degrees. Minus 11 degrees. Or if you have minus 5 degrees now and it falls 4 degrees, it gets colder, it gets more negative. So we have minus 9 degrees. Okay. And we're all done.